our April release will be the, the 2014 vintage of, uh, of Cabernet Sauvignon. And uh, since 2001, we have made uh, two different bottlings, the Reserve, which is all estate, and then the, the Napa label, which is mostly estate, between 75 and 80% estate, and the remainder from the Pope Valley. Um, and again, 2014, I want to underscore again the, uh, the importance of having an estate vineyard. And that means a vineyard that you own your own land, you farm it for a long time, uh, you get to know it and you get to hopefully perfect it. And now that we've been up here for 41 years, we really have things growing, I think, in the right spot. Again, the marker for this vintage, which uh, almost brought me to tears, so to speak, uh, at harvest, during fermentation, and then during the first few months of barrel aging was to see the, the, the lushness, the sweetness, and the quality, the smoothness of the tannins. Because that was the thing we wrestled with the most in the first 20 years of our history was Mountain Cabernet being a little too rustic. To see new layers of flavor with the addition of having that mountain power there, but having the tannins so well integrated and so smooth from the beginning and the wines being so expressive, it was just amazing. So that really strikes me in the 14 minutes as being the most I've seen those qualities all come together. And uh, literally, I remember being on the crush pad, which is right over there, with uh, with Matt, guys saying, you know, we're experiencing something that no one has ever experienced in history. We're the first people to farm Bordeaux varietals, and also Chardonnay, and not Zinfandel, but because uh, that's been farmed here before. We're the first people to farm these varietals on this property in history. No one's ever done it. So we're the first people seeing you know, what happens when wines are, vines are five years old, 10 years old, 15 years old, and now they're in that, that fourth quadrant from 15 to 20. And uh, so it's just great sense of almost pioneering. Uh, we're the first people to see it, which is really, really exciting. And uh, these, these wines will shine out of the gate, uh, but also because of their structure, uh, their acidity. I mean, 14 was not a blazingly hot year, so they've got great acidity. They're gonna last again for a long time. But to me, it's how delicious these wines are right now. It's, it's pretty amazing.